Joe, and you're at the Joe is Hungry channel. I'm at the Checkers in Calhoun, Georgia. It is a cold and blustery day. I'm gonna check out their new fry seasoned chicken tenders. Could I get three orders of three fry or uh, seasoned fried? Say that one more time, I'm sorry. Could I get three orders of fry seasoned three piece chicken tenders? Three orders of them? Correct. It'd be 13 13, thank you. Joe is hungry, three words. I've got my three orders of chicken tenders. Let's pull off to the side and do the Joe is hungry temperature test. Chicken strips number one comes in at 207.9 degrees Fahrenheit. That's got to be a new record. Order number two comes in at 202.1 degrees Fahrenheit. How do you get started doing all this? Hey, hold on one second, because these things are not getting warmer. Order number two comes in at 174.2 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hot, that's fresh, just pulled out of the fryer. You set the new record. Calhoun checkers, you are rock stars. You win the Joe is Hungry temperature test. Now it's time for a little more evaluation. So let's roll on back to the studios of Joe is Hungry, located in my semi-adopted hometown of Fairmount, Georgia. If you like my channel, subscribe, support, leave a comment. Checkers new fried seasoned chicken tenders is made up of white meat chicken tenders coated in Checkers seasoned fried batter. I always get excited when they set a new record on the temperature test. This was previously set by Popeyes. This thing comes in at a blistering and burning and all time record. 207.7 degrees Fahrenheit with the 207.9 degrees Fahrenheit. An a la carte order of three will set you back $4.39, five will set you back $6.89, and an eight piece will set you back $9.99. Checkers doesn't post any nutritional stats beside the calorie count. I called the useless customer service number. They told me absolutely nothing. The three piece weighs in at 410 calories, the five piece weighs in at 680 calories, and the eight piece weighs in at 1,020 calories. Now it's time for the Joe is Hungry weight test. And as usual, they don't post any serving weights. So I bought three orders of three so I could check for consistency between seasoned chicken strips and fries seasoned chicken strips. Chicken strip order number one comes in at 4.95 ounces. Chicken strip number two comes in at 4.85 ounces. Chicken strip number three comes in at 4.55 ounces. That's pretty close. We'll give them a pass on the Joe is Hungry consistency weight test. But that's not all. I posted a few chicken strip weights from previous videos. Just for reference, I have them up on the screen and in the description below. Now it's time for the Joe is Hungry big reveal. and this is what they're supposed to look like. This is what they look like, and this is what they're supposed to look like. We've seen what they look like, we saw how much they were, we don't know what the nutritional stats are, but they were definitely cooked hot and they were definitely cooked fresh. Now it's time for the Joe is Hungry bite test. And it is bite test, engage. <laughs>
seasoning, I gotta say, really works well with these. They are very crispy and very crunchy. These things are cooked perfectly. They are a standalone item, don't even need dipping sauce. Maybe a little sour cream, but what doesn't? I used to think Dairy Queen had some of the best chicken strips. The chicken strips they are, have a really good flavor. They're actually pretty decent. But not anymore. They are very well seasoned. They're very crunchy, even being 30 minutes old. As far as a value, $4.39 for three chicken strips seems a little bit pricey, but not too far out of line. I just can't quit eating these things. I think you really need to go and try these things out. Now it's time to give this thing a score. If y'all don't know my scale, my scale is one to 10, nine being best. Anything above nine is a once in a lifetime experience. Five and down is the slippery slope to food hell. So let's go ahead and give this thing a score that it really deserves. Mm. Mm. I love these things. The fry seasoning just kills it. They were cooked fresh and hot too. Set a new record. I'm gonna have to go with a, I'm gonna have to go with a 7.9. That is a very high number. This is a very good chicken tender. That is my number, that is my review, and we will see you in the next video.